हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज अमृतपाल फाउंडर ऑफ अमृतपाल विजन आज मैं आ चुका हूँ धवल के साथ में फेल डिकेंसन यूनिवर्सिटी वैनकोवर में आज है हम लोग वैनकोवर डाउनटाउन और आज है हम लोग नए कैंपस टूर नई सिटी में और ये बहुत एक स्पेशल प्रोफाइल है बहुत स्पेशल कैंपस टूर है क्योंकि कल ही मेरे पास एक केस आया था रिलेटेड टू बी डी इंडिया में जो डेंटिस्ट्री स्टूडेंट्स करते हैं कल ही एक केस आया स्टूडेंट का रिजेक्शन आया था क्योंकि उसने एक कॉलेज डिप्लोमा कोर्स में एप्लीकेशन किया था रिलेटेड टू एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन यार अभी एक डॉक्टर लेवल का आदमी एक एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन के कोर्स में एप्लीकेशन करे वो भी डिप्लोमा लेवल के तो आप कैसे वीजा एक्सपेक्ट जो है वो कर सकते हो ऐसे कभी वीजा नहीं आता है तो टू में धवल ने जो एप्लीकेशन है वो खुद से किया था बट जो वीजा है उसके लिए हमारे से इन्होंने हेल्प लिया था और हमने इसका वीजा जो है इस यूनिवर्सिटी में करके दिया था अभी हम लोग फेले डिकेंसन यूनिवर्सिटी वैनकोवर में तो आप ये समझिए कि अगर आपने इंडिया में किया है बी तो आपको कोई छोटे मोटे कोर्स में अप्लाई नहीं करना है अच्छे एक प्रोग्राम में अप्लाई करना है जो आपको यहाँ पर वीजा जो है वो दिला सकते दिला सके क्योंकि डॉक्टर लेवल का कोर्स है तो मास्टर्स लेवल का कोर्स आपको जरूर लेके आना है तो हमने जो है धवल को गाइड किया था कि आप मास्टर्स इन एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन साइंसेस में आप जाइए तो आपका वीजा जो है वो बहुत इजीली लग सकता है तो यस ये एडमिशन ले आए थे वीजा पूरा प्रोसेस हमने इनको करके दिया था और 2018 में ग्रेजुएट हो गए थे यहाँ से और अभी ये लोग प्रिपेयर कर रहे हैं यहाँ की जो लोकल एग्जाम होती है जो रजिस्टर्ड डेंटिस्ट बनने की उसके लिए प्रिपेयर कर रहे हैं पी हो चुके हैं आज सुबह से ये घुमा रहे हैं हमको और अभी अपना दिखाएंगे कैंपस हमारे को सो धवल कैसे हो आप बस बढ़िया कैसे हो बस बढ़िया तो अमृतपाल और विजन के साथ आपका एक्सपीरियंस कैसा रहा आपने लास्ट आठ साल से एक दूसरे को जान रहे हैं बहुत ही बढ़िया रहा पहले तो हमने सोचा था कि अभी जाना है कनेडा पर कैसे जाएंगे क्योंकि पहले इंडिया में तो ऐसा है कि हम कहीं बाहर गए ही नहीं है पर हमने सोचा की चलो ढूंढते है कोई कंसल्टेंट अच्छा कंसल्टेंट मिलता है दो तीन जगह घूमे फिर कॉन्टेक्ट से मुझे अमृतपाल मिल गए फिर मैंने उनसे दो तीन बार मुलाकात की कि कैसे रहेगा ये सब तो उन्होंने समझा है कि आप तो फर्स्ट केस हो जैसे कि डेंटल डेंटिस्ट्री वाला इंसान यहाँ से बाहर जा रहा है तो उनके लिए एक ही कोर्स है वैनकूवर में वो मास्टर ऑफ एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव साइंस है तो उसके बाद हमने क्या है कि आई की प्रिपरेशन की मैंने वहाँ पे ही की थी अमृतपाल विजन में Hmm. फिर बैंड्स आए मेरे 6.5 और 7 समथिंग आ गए और उसके बाद फिर अमृतपाल जी ने हेल्प किया यहाँ पे एडमिशन दिलवाया मैं जब यहाँ पे आया तब भी उन्होंने मेरा पूरा सपोर्ट किया है कि कैसे करना है कैसे वहाँ पे सब रिलेशनशिप बनानी है फ्रेंड सर्कल ये है अभी भी आपको अभी, याद है नहीं आठ हाँ। साल पहले की बात अभी भी आपको याद है <laughs> वैसे right. फिर यहाँ पे आए फिर सेट हो गए right. अभी भी मैंने पीआर के वक्त अमृतपाल को पूछा था कि कैसे चल रहा है सब कुछ अभी भी इंडिया दो था दो महीने पहले मिले हैं ना बिल्कुल अभी मैं मैं यही बोल रहा था कि दुनिया कितनी छोटी अभी ऑफिस में आए थे <laughs> क्योंकि इनके भाई का जो केस है अभी हम लोग कर रहे हैं तो अभी ऑफिस में मार्च में हम लोग मिले थे फिर अभी जून है जून में इनके साथ में इधर वैनकोवर में खड़ा हूँ सो धवल आज हमको आप बताएंगे आपका कैंपस टूर राइट जितना हो सके ट्राई करना आप बताना पता ही है वैसे तो पर जितना हो सके हम एक्सप्लोर करेंगे वैनकोवर कैंपस को थैंक यू लेट्स गो ओवर आई हैव माय स्टूडेंट मिस्टर धवल विद मी हु स्टडीड हियर इन 2016 इन 2018 ही ग्रेजुएटेड इन द कोर्स ऑफ मास्टर्स इन एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव साइंसेस आई आल्सो हैव मिस्टर पीटर uh from uh, fdu he is working in a marketing department he will show us his campus today uh, we will see two campuses one is this the vancouver campus and we'll go to georgia campus which is near by 10 minutes from this place so mr peter what do you want to uh, say to the students who are coming from india hello everyone from india and i hope you guys enjoy the campus tour i'm about to give you guys and it's a really good university a lot of good facilities and we're right in downtown a lot of good food so you won't get homesick and anyone wants to study here please contact uh, mr amrad pal thank you thank you let's go let's go hi my 
my name is Tawal and right. I'm here to make yeah, a, a tour of yeah. one campus here. Oh, Tawal, pleasure to meet you. Thank my name you. is Peter. I'm the coordinator of marketing and uh, communications here sure. at FDU Vancouver. Sure. I'm more than happy to give you the tour. Sure, here. thank you so much. Uh, so, you know, our campus is located in downtown Vancouver yes. and um, the one thing I say to students is a lot of good restaurants. So, yes. a lot of international students, yes. I think you know this one as well, uh, a lot of different food. That's very important to me. I believe that's very important to students yes. as well. So, front entrance over here on the left side, over here, uh, we have the marketing department, which okay. is where our marketing and recruitment uh, works, so three offices, and this is the big meeting room uh, where we used to meet agents, uh, counselors, and our special guests over here. So if you want, I can open the door to have you yeah. take a look at the facilities. Sure. So push it in. So the office over here, and um, actually, uh, recently we have a plan to develop this one into uh, offices because we're having more staff and faculties. Mm -hmm. So this meeting room will stay, but we have two more tables over there for right. for staff right. members. Yeah, for staff. Yeah. Exactly. Yep. Yeah. Right. So this is the room. I'll take you guys to the student lounge. Over sure. There. So reception area is where our wonderful yes. staff work at too. Yes. They greet. <laughs> our students and uh, staff and faculties every single day okay. and uh, front of the school, very hardworking. So this is the reception area and uh, we have our wonderful staff member over here represent the school, face of the school and they greet our students, staff members and faculties every single day. And the hallway over here. So Tawa, when was the time you studied here? So I came in May 2016 here. May 2016. Um, I graduated in 2018. Okay, I see. Yes, February. 2018. Yes. Does this look familiar to you? Yes, <laughs> okay. yes. Exactly. Everything's very familiar. <laughs> So this area is the hallway once we pass here. We have the student lounge hmm. at this area. Yes. So this is the kitchen uh, where students, you know, they, they will be able to heat their lunch or um, countertops, go watch their, exactly. their utensils. Exactly. Feel like a student again? Yes. <laughs> yes, it's like this. Yeah, exactly. I think if I were a student, this is the place I would enjoy yes. the most, right? So this is the student lounge over here. Um, as you see, students will be having lunch, work on their projects, assignments, etc. And here we have a TV. Uh, this is basically a living room where students yes. can sit down, enjoy the news. We we'll always have the news on. Or sometimes if there's a sports event. Yeah, sports event. Yeah. I'm hoping for the World Cup, they really have the games on. So that's what I'm hoping for. Yeah. Sure. And this board over here is our events calendar. So uh, if there's any event that the students wants to join, it will be on here. This is all designed by our student services department. So uh, we we'll really look to provide students with a complete experience. So this is... Um, the club, the club stay, for example, over here, and uh, different events where students can sign up. So this area, I won't go too into details for it. So this would be our executive's um, office over there, and student services. So this is the office area oh. over here. So furthermore, uh, we're walking down this hallway where we will go to our IT department. And there are also a classroom over here. So um, uh, when students have questions, anything related to IT, they'll come to this office where our uh, staff members will be able to help them. And also, um, there will be a student IT assistant usually working in this room over here. So in the after hours, if students have any questions related to you know, using the computer, mm -hmm. have any technical issues, they will come here and then we will have a student assistant to help them with any IT related issues. All right, all right. Yes. So now I will take you guys down to the uh, entertainment room. Devil, have you used that at the downstairs yep. before? You have, right? Yeah. So you know there's a gaming room. Yes, yeah. gaming room. Gaming room. Um, yeah. So now we're downstairs. Um, where we have our games room and um, students like to call it uh, a sleep room <laughs> and also it's the study room over study here room yeah well. study room over here it's the sleep room so i'll open the door it's this one so yeah oh this is the place uh, where students you know can just relax 
use the computers to work on their projects, etc. And uh, there are sleeping bags on that yeah. side. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you, you must be familiar yeah. with this one. So, uh, yeah, if they just feel stressed and uh, yeah. if they feel so tired, they, nap or something. Yeah, they use this one. Take a nap whenever you like. <laughs> this is the best thing. This is the best thing, exactly. <laughs> So, yeah, aside from the student lounge, in my opinion, because that's the best thing for me because there's food. Yeah. <laughs> after eating, you come here to have, yeah. a, have a nap, so that's the best thing for me. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, the game room is uh, over here. So, I'll open the door. Okay. Come in here. So, we have a table tennis uh, table over here. Mm -hmm. This one. Uh, so how students can get the racket is they go to the front desk. Front desk, yes. Yeah. So you know it seems yeah. like you play the seventh floor. Yeah, so, <laughs> yes. so yeah, they get that, and also there's a pillars okay. game where they can enjoy the yes, soccer game, yes, yes. tabletop exactly. soccer game tabletop. over here. Or if you just want to get away from the classrooms and mm -hmm. just come yes, here for too. for your little time on yeah. own space, that's no problem. <laughs> So now we're upstairs on the second floor of our Vancouver campus over here. So Dao, you're familiar with this place yes, too, right? Yes, sometimes we used to do assignments here. Exactly. Does assignment, that bring yeah. good memories or bad memories? Yeah, good memories. Good memories? Yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> good. This one is quiet place so we can do our assignment or exactly. next. So okay. yes, so here are the study areas for students too. And uh, enough computers for everyone, yes. I would say. Yeah, so, so a good thing about- We can use the computer here and we can print our documents over there for like a, we get almost $20 pre print print exactly yes. so you guys can print whatever assignments yes. that you want yes so uh, one thing good I would say about FDU is that we really have the top-notch facilities we provide students with the support so anytime they have questions or if there's anything that they're looking for we try to make it happen for students so yes. students well-being is a very important part for the school over here as well so this, I would call it a library, um, yes. library. space. Yes. So uh, study area, usually it's very quiet right here. So the quiet study area. And here are the resources uh, students have access to. So over here, we have a few different classrooms and a few offices as well. I'll see if I can get into one. Let's see if it works. The lights, the, the switch is not on You're here because they don't have class oh, classes yes. here. But yes, a decent classroom over here. So I don't know if the lighting is okay. Get a little bit of, of the sense. So a cl classroom like this is another specialty that we have. We usually keep small class sizes, so our students can really get the tailored and a specific help from professors. And they get a study plan that's tailored for them as well. So we have our enrollment service over here. He's trying to find himself. <laughs> so our enrollment service is over here. Admissions office over here on this side. And this area, we have the uh, enrollment services lounge over here. So this front desk over here, uh, students usually come to pay their tuitions, ask for enroll yeah, enrollment. Exactly. I'm sure you've been here before yes. too. So everything here. Hi, oh, yeah. how's it going? Hi, Wing. So I would say this is another very important uh, part of the school because uh, Students will come here very often, register for classes, and doing anything that's financially related. Yes. Yes. So it's a relatively more quiet yes. than other terms, much yes. like. Yes. Uh, more computers. Yeah. So we really provide students with more than enough facilities, technologies to help them make their study life easier. So that's uh, another thing that we really focus on. We want students to do well, and we have all the resources to help them achieve that. Mm -hmm. So classrooms, seems like a class just finished, or they're just having lunch. Yes. Okay. More computers on this side. Any professors you might recognize, Devo? Mm. 
No, 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 no. right? Okay. So there's an elevator that students can use um, to come up and down. On this side is more faculty side. So this hallway right here is a professor's hallway. It's the offices of faculty members and professors. So when students you know, have troubles or questions related to their classes, they can always book a meeting with their professors. Our professors, um, they try to help the students the best they can. And then if they want uh, any questions, they want to have their questions answered or extra helps, book a meeting with the professors. They will be able to help the students over here. So Dava, yeah, your classes, were they mostly downstairs or are they upstairs? Uh, no, on the second floor. On the second floor, floor so yes. you spent more time here yeah, on, the more second, on, on the floor. second floor. Yeah. Um, did you like this one, the second floor better? Or? Yes, this one was quiet. Uh, very quiet. Very quiet, right? Yes. Okay. So you like quiet, quiet not, not yes. crowded place. No. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, for me, uh, yeah, it's definitely harder to, to concentrate yeah. if it's uh, crowded. Yeah. So again, the view of downtown Vancouver on this side. So yeah. if you ever feel like um, you're stressed, uh, downstairs, yeah. we have sleeping bags here, but also you can stay here to take a nap. Yeah. <laughs> I would say it's a very yeah. good view too. We used too. to sit here and yeah. do our assignment after our study and oh, then nice. we go back home. Nice, nice. 12.30 at night? 12.30 p.m. Right, yeah. uh, um, the Lunch class was like 6 to 9 p.m. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah. Okay, okay. Sometimes it was 3 to 6, so we he came here to complete our assignments. Oh, I see, okay. Or yeah. before the class start, we come here to study. Okay, yeah, for me, I'll choose this desk because <laughs> you, you finish yeah. your typing on computer, you look outside, you feel better. Yeah, right? better. yeah. So again, I really like the view. It's, mm -hmm, it's a shame yes. that uh, Vancouver weather isn't helping today, yeah. but uh, when it's sunny, you know this? So yeah. Vancouver is gorgeous. <laughs> so our view is very, very yes. nice. These were the class where I used to study most. Yes, so this is the classroom. So. Yeah. You definitely you yeah, stayed here. I okay, use this okay. Class more. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Bad memories or good memories? No, good memories. Good memories. Okay. <laughs> okay. Good, good. Good. Such a nice. Yeah. We used to give us like a PPT or PowerPoint presentation yeah. here. We yeah. Used to give it. Yeah. So again, we really keep our technologies, you know, on the same standard as today's technology. So whatever we can use to help students uh, achieve their goals, we use high-end technologies, TVs, so to give professors and students the best ex experience possible. Again, small class sizes, so which really diverse us from a lot of other universities. So we give students tailored study plans, and that way uh, they have a better experience at studying. So this is pretty much the second floor. So we had a tour on the second floor. So uh, when was the last time you visited campus, Devo? Uh, I came in 2019 to pick up my transcripts here. Okay, so that was the last time you, yeah, you visited? Yeah, the last time I visited. Okay, okay. So you're in Vancouver long for, for, for like... Five to six years. Okay. Five to six years, yes. okay, okay. Yeah. So would you say FDU is part of your family? Yes. Right? Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, again... a lot of friends here. Exactly. So another thing we really focus on is that um, we really try to build that friendship uh, between friends uh, between students and um, their clubs. That's that's why we create so many clubs for students to participate. Yes. So when they meet each other, they build the family bond uh, and the friendship. We used to play in cricket club here. Oh, nice, nice, yeah. yeah. Unfortunately, during COVID, I think that was yeah, shut down, but, that. but now we're slowly picking it up. So <laughs> yeah. student experience. Hopefully they find girlfriend and boyfriend. <laughs> right? So that's our next goal yes. over here. So yes, so this is the second floor. And then let's yeah. go downstairs. So we're in downtown Vancouver right now, and as you can see, our school is right close to the BC place. So this is a big stadium over there. So uh, soccer games, international soccer games, and uh, football games, a lot of different places will be taking place in that stadium over there. It's one of the most famous uh, stadiums in the entire Canada. We have our team, Vancouver Whitecaps. Exactly, we have a Vancouver Whitecaps team over there. That's the big famous soccer team. Hello everyone, now we're at our FDU uh, Georgia location. This is a brand new facility. 
and uh, this be outside of your knowledge, Dabo, right? Yes, <laughs> exactly. Been here for exactly. Yes, so let's have a tour. We're here. Down this way, we have more offices, and we have a place that's another student lounge of the Georgia location. So here, students are free to have lunch, study on their own, and we also have uh, many machines, fridges, and um, microwaves. Yes. Students can have lunch. Would you Would you eat here, Davo, or, or the other campus? I like them. Uh, here, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm starting to find more your style now. So. <laughs> So student lounge, again, uh, we don't have access to this balcony just because of safety reasons, safety of right. course. Yes. So we don't want we don't want anyone just wander outside, <laughs> check the view and then... Yes. yes. But the view here is amazing. Yeah. You can see Vancouver Harbor. And across the water is the North Vancouver. So once we're done from the student lounge, uh, this way is another study area over here. A lot of computers where students will be able to uh, study, do homework, work on assignments, etc. etc. So, here we have another student lounge uh, where they can have lunch, microwaves, fridges. I would say the view here is better. Yeah, yeah. So, you have the view of the water over there. Uh, so soon this was our campus tour of FDU. Right now we are at FDU's Georgia campus, which is on the 11th floor of a high-rise building in the downtown, Vancouver downtown. So here is Mr. Peter who has shown us the campuses, both the campuses. And here is my student Mr. Dhawal who studied here in 2016, got graduated in 2018. Right now he is having permanent residency here in Canada. So uh, if you want to study here at FDU in Vancouver, you can always contact Amrit Vision. Amrit Vision will be your one-stop solution for all your study in Canada needs. And after this video, we are going to the next campus, next university. So don't forget to subscribe my channel that is Amrit Vision because you will see 100 plus campus around the world because right now I am on a world education tour and I will cover all the universities where my student has studied. So Dhawal has studied here so I came personally in Vancouver to meet him to see this university because I never saw the campus of FDU because I sent him uh, here in Canada in 2016. So it's 2022 after eight years we are meeting after six years we are meeting him. So Dhawal how was your experience studying here in FDU? It was good. Like uh, in India, we used to study in a small classroom. Mm -hmm. Here, we used to study in big classroom. Small, or less students, like 20 students per class. And we have to use the cafeteria for free of cost. Okay. But we used to use the computer lab here for free of cost. Okay, great. Good. Great, great. So, Mr. Peter, uh, he is Mr. Peter. He is working here in marketing department. So, he was, uh, he, was, he was with us today to show us the campus around both the campuses. So, Mr. Peter, what do you want to say to so the students? Again, again, friends, students, come to FDU Vancouver. We guarantee you have a wonderful education and a personal experience. And please contact Amri Pal. And, uh, Look to have you here. And subscribe my channel. Subscribe, please. Subscribe <laughs> this guy. Thank you. Thank you. See you soon, guys. Have a good time. And also follow my Instagram handle where you will get all the details where I'm going next, which city I'm covering and which university I'm going to. Bye-bye. See you.